storm as a me and happy Juneteenth. I will leave it at that. I promised myself that I would not go off on a tangent, so voila. I, I forgot to post yesterday. Um, like I was so exhausted once we made it to our um, destination. The traffic was insane. I hope Pe that everyone made it to their destination. Okay, I finally found a coffee shop. I ordered a cappuccino and this is what I got. It's bigger than my bun. I'm um, speaking of buns. I need to wash my hair this weekend. I'm, I'm guessing once we get home. Vintage Mezzamino, I utterly detest anything that has to do with hair. Hair salons, styling, hair, any of that. I would rather get a pap smear than have to do my hair. Like, it, it, it's that bad. I've never been into that. So, uh, I have to get to it soon because this is going to be um, just a busy week. I had on yesterday to catch up and just forgot to post. Nonetheless, I hope that you all are well. I have a few hours um, of downtime, so to speak. So I want to use that to work on next week's vlog. I'm editing as much as I can so I could just get it posted. But yeah, let me enjoy this cappuccino. I pulled over to reply to an email. And um, yeah, get back so I can do a bit of editing. And then finally my hair. I don't wanna do. <laughs> All right, ciao for now. So I have some friends that I want you to be. Oh, you're, you're a little bit of a shut crab. Then you can handle them. I can handle them. You can handle them. I'm sorry, but I, I've been in front of shut crab before. Nothing like this. I'll be right back. Lord Mesa Me, I have finally finished editing that first video. <sighs> haven't even started on the actual vlog yet. I hope you all are having a fabulous day. All right, ciao. Sure, Mess and me, and happy Monday. I hope that you all had a fabulous weekend. Saturday, no, Sunday, yesterday was Father's Day. I have not vlogged in some time. I think the last time I vlogged it was Saturday. Nonetheless, it is a new week. I am having my second caffeinated beverage of the day. This is a cappuccino. I had a macchiato earlier. Super excited. I went for a walk today. This is my first time taking a walk in about six weeks or so. Um, 14 states were affected by like the brood X cicadas. Gross. It's so awful. But for the most part, they have subsided. So that was really nice just to get back out and about. It feels so good. Over on Instagram, I um, shared some of my weight loss, um, just the journey. I um, was able to zip my pants. And these are like pants with no stretch in it last week. So that was huge progress. So I'm really excited that I um, am back walking again. Right now I am editing my vlog that will post tomorrow. Need to get that done. I um, My esthetician was able to fit me in today. So I have a wax appointment and I need to um, head to the other city to do some errands with Juju the camera kid, a bit of shopping. Super excited about that. Of course, I will take you all avec moi, but I really want to enjoy this cappuccino before it gets cold and finish up editing. I'll flip the camera so you can see. All right, ciao for now. Someone asked for me, I am moving. Now I am heading to the mall to pick up something for Ju. So excited my baby's graduating. <laughs> I didn't think they were going to have it in person, but they are. So a lot of moving parts and I'm trying to make it to the barbershop. So be right back. Is the chocolate almond milk the only kind? Oh no, we the oat milk, brown sugar oat. And what size did you want to try? Uh, I will. Nope, oh, that'll be okay. all. It's a five for you. Thank you. Thanks. I am uncertain how much you all were able to hear in the mall because um, the music, my mask, and I didn't want to yell. So yeah, ran into the mall because um, Juju the camera kid is graduating this week, and I wanted to get him a little something special to wear and 
Yeah, so like trying to get a barber appointment. So far, it seems as though I am making good timing, but traffic, it is like bumper to bumper. It's half past two and it already appears that it's like rush hour, like every hour is rush hour at this point. But yeah, so doing that, and um, I wanted to stop at the post office. I don't know if I will have time to do that. Maybe I can do that when I come back now. I'm thinking aloud. It's the second time I'm trying this. Well, actually, no, the first, because the first time I had the almond. Signal GPS perdu. I don't know why my GPS is talking to me. <laughs> I had the chocolate almond milk. So this, it's it's pretty good. It's just, it's really not my thing. Like, cold coffee is very foreign to my like awful but it, it's not something that I look forward to I'll say that so yeah let me get a podcast in because I, I have my French placement exam and I need to really get on it because this week again with Jews graduation and all and then we are going out of town a family trip super excited it'll be a road trip I'm still too nervous to fly but I'm rambling on so I will check back in when I can all right ciao for now this morning super excited I did because I started not to and then went back and forth and once I finally did it started raining like as soon as I got home so I'm glad I got out to do that because it's been raining all day um two cappuccino kind of day it has been one of those days and baby china is asleep so I really want to sneak and eat my gelato because now that she's eating table food she wants it all the expensive gelatos that's that's her <laughs> that's her thing that's her jam so I'm going to sneak that in I have a few more things to do I'm thinking about going live this um evening on insta I have not done that in over a year so I have some stuff just to do in the um, dressing room pretty much folding clothes I feel like I'm always folding clothes and I don't know why because I feel like I wear the same few things but say la vie so I need to get that done, pack, I may not pack today, I think I'm going to wait. Nonetheless, I'm rambling on and I want to eat my gelato in peace. So I'm going to check back in when I can. Alrighty, ciao for now. That's me. I hope this works. Okay, so I went live on Instagram. This is the newest um, Christopher John Rogers dress that I purchased after um, I uploaded the vlog so a picture I tried it on today I um, was going to take a picture but it looks so awful with the red lipstick that I had on and I'm just really tired and you can tell so I'm getting ready to have a glass of wine and relax tomorrow is a big day Juju continue to be kind now I know courageous starts with the skin Here starts to see in times but I'm still going to continue to be kind Mezzanine, so Juju the camera kid has sparkling elderflower soda and he's pretending like he's drunk. <laughs> Is that how drunk people are? Yes. What drunk person have you seen? Uh, Caillou. <laughs> Caillou, of course. under the influence. Ciao for now. He's under the elderflower. That's amazing. So just leaving. Um, we had a really nice um, luncheon for Juju's graduation. And I need some retail therapy. We have this. This color is cute. Yeah. I needed some much needed retail therapy, so I'm gonna see 
what I can find. I just arrived to Bloomies. Oh, this is the dress. This is gorge. Oh, absolutely. I'm always here. Perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. We'll do. me and happy Thursday. Yeah. Yesterday, Wednesday was Ju's graduation. So I was in full on like emotional mommy mode. We had such an amazing time. Um, Ju's dad, my ex-husband, took us all out for dinner at one of our, um, Julius and I's favorite French restaurants. It was lovely. It was just amazing for Julius to be surrounded by so much love. I'm like, not gonna even get into it because I get all emotional. I um, did like a whole story today um, on my daily walk. I had some things to do around the house. I we are, I'm going away for the weekend. I have not packed, I'm gonna do that. I got and my nails done. This is like a huge deal, pour moi. Artificial nails, I get so scared. Like with my own nails, I'll do all the colors finally. But there's something about adding nails that makes me so afraid. I forgot how expensive the nail salon is. So I only get pedicures and I don't even do gel. I do standard polish for my toes, but for my nails, I stopped because nothing lasts. And it does not matter how much I spend, what brand, it does not work. Like I have had 80 euro, 90 euro dips, powders, gels, and nothing will last. So I did a poll asking Mezami, what should I do? It's always something new and more expensive. But I just went ahead and did acrylic because that's the thing that lasts the longest. And when I say the longest, I mean like a week or so. I am hoping this is going to go well. I was in a rush to get back home. So I ended up getting gel so not only did i do acrylic i did gel as well it is so expensive i spent so much money today and again the husband always laughs and calls me frugal i swear the husband is like the first person in history to save money by having a baby i say that because before baby china we were always together when i would go to malls or salons and so he would pick up the bill but now that one of us has to stay home with her I'm gonna have to start grabbing his card on the way out. I couldn't believe how much I spent for, because everything was an upcharge. Of course, the gel, that was an upcharge. I wanted a French, that was an upcharge. The fact that I wanted my nails so short was an upcharge. I'm like, OMG, these things better last all summer 2021. <laughs> But yes, yeah, so yes. I want to um, go ahead and put up my coffee. I will show you all um, some of the coffees that I got. Same stuff for the most part, but I'm trying to get into this whole iced coffee business. I don't know, but we'll see. Yeah, let me do that. And then I will take you all back up to the dressing room. I know. Oh, I, yesterday I did record a little. You'll see. <laughs> all righty. Ciao for now. Oh, this Hermes. The husband got this um, for... I think just because. Alrighty, shower for now. Oh, what's in the bag? So these are oldie but good. Oh, I forgot I opened one today already. So I do like single shots of espresso. That's my jam. Um, totally. Always get the recycle bag. Oh, these are pretty. They change the bag. Um, does it come with the label? Yeah, the kind that I that they usually give come with a label for UPS. So, so this is the new one that I am trying. The, um, tropical coconut over ice. Single shot. But this is for my mare because I have decaffeinated coffee. So I picked this up for her. So I am going to set up the tripod and let you all watch me refill this. Actually, I don't have much space. So let's see. Alrighty. Ciao for now. And 
we will be going for a road trip tomorrow, going on a road trip tomorrow. So I really want to try this. I am going to go ahead and brew it tonight and put it in the fridge. I need to pack. And this is a seven ounce. This is, oh, actually I need to refill this. I'm glad I saw it. I should Google this to see how much coffee is in, or how many ounces rather, is in like a venti, um, grande, you know, just like Starbucks sizes, because I don't know. So this is 7.7 .7 ounces. I'm assuming this is about the amount we would get with most Starbucks drinks, but of course, once you add all of the ice, because I'm only questioning if I should brew another, but that would be 14 ounces. Okay, let me do a quick Google. Tall is 12 ounces. Oh, wow, okay. Okay, so 16 ounces. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'll make another. And I am finally getting ready to pack baby Gina was not having it. So <laughs> I had to wait for her to go to sleep so I could pack. I spent the weekend in Boston, baby Gina and I, and I only packed my LV Neverfull GM. We took the train. I'm go back and check my Boston blog when you can, but the husband is going to be with me this time and we are driving so i am going to take my keep all because i haven't you oh yeah i forgot about that i marked that up i feel like um there's i can get this out i will i know what to do but it's been some time since i actually used my keep all i did a review on all of my travel pieces this is why I am packed. I'm actually, I'm wearing this tomorrow. This will be the dress for Saturday. That's another one of my LV pieces. Garment bag. I um, vlogged about that as well. And the other dress that I am packing, my Old Faithful. Actually, the dress I had on today, my off-the-shoulder dress. That will be for the return trip. So that's all I'm packing. I have my, this is my phone. I can set this right here. My nightgown, my toiletry pouch. I'm taking a bigger toiletry pouch and not my um, LV because I need more. And honestly, not a lot of stuff fits in here. So yeah, let me go ahead and get packed. So I have packed pretty much everything. This is like my social media pouch. It has like all of my adapters, chargers, um, just everything I really need to vlog and vlog. Amazami sent me this, but she did not put her like Insta tag handle. So I was not able to thank her. It actually, it was a set. So it was this bag. Isn't this so nice? It was this bag and the pouch was inside. And I want to thank them, if not publicly. I know a lot of mes and me want to be anonymous and that's totally fine. I respect anonymity, but I at least wanted to say thank you. So I am packed. I think I'm going to go and have some gelato and call it a night because we have such a long day tomorrow. Alrighty, ciao for now.